Hey guys, how's it going? It is, um, what is it? Yeah, it's October 3rd, 2017, 9.05 p.m. So I was just checking my email. Now, originally I was going to do something else, and I was going to get back into Run 8 tomorrow night, but since uh, an update has come out, I figured I want to see what this is all about. Something caught my eye and that is the filters. Now this was something that I had heard rumors of that were coming. Um, there's already filters in it, so let's just take a quick look here and see what this is all about. I just upgraded, so we'll see everything goes as planned. Um, of course, I'm in the southeast. I don't know if I'll just run this for a little bit and play with it might as well oh, oh yeah I was uh, about to uh that I was in the middle of crossing. I don't know what I'm doing. Oh, I don't think. A little bit behind. One. What did I have coming up at 12 o'clock today? Oh, yeah. So he's in the middle of. Oh, crap. That's not good. I think that's. Never good when there's a train on a crossing. But fortunately for me, it wasn't of a. Uh... Oh, he's just starting up. Okay. Clouds are moving better. I don't know what that means. Okay, so it's clearing flat. Well, this is where the other Tracks on his way past the twelve o'clock marks so start to safe we'll throw him. Okay, so filters. I don't know if I can do filters while this is on. I forget how I do that. There's the filters. Okay. Um... I'm willing, I'm willing to, uh, let's see here. What kind of filters do we have? It looked like there was, there was a bunch, and I, and I did. What? Is that? Whoa. Okay, now that's got my attention. Wow, I'm about to tear up. 
Did that, did that just do what I think it just did? Okay, this, this, let, let, we, I gotta read up on this now. Hold on a second here. Hold on. I knew there was card types, but something, okay. Interacting with AI train crews. I gotta see this. The, the new stuff is down here. Now, the reason why I said I gotta tear up for a second is just like, whoa. I swear, these guys, you know, they tick me off sometimes and then they come up with an update and they, it's just like... So... Let me get away from this traffic here for... That's gonna just disturb me. Or not, a train's gonna... Um... Okay, this could change a lot of things. go into the peaceful confines of my tower. I'm going to let this run for a minute because actually let me let me see what's coming up. I probably shouldn't even be running uh, but I want to test it out right on the fly and see what we've got going on here. Uh, blah 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 blah. Uh, let me... Well I'll be thinking about this tomorrow. If this is, I'm going to try this out tonight and see what happens. So let's see what we got going on at 12 o'clock. Okay, hang on a second. So I got a Q409. Okay. I'm going to delay that train. Or maybe I might even play around with that train. Q401, Q409 is supposed to come um, from here. So that's the local freight symbols. That's all the various... Yeah, and Callahan sub. And what is in Callahan? Just out of curiosity, no, nah, I don't want to. That, that, that's, I, I know what that is. That's my dummy little industry thing, and I'm not even too sure if that's going to work anymore. Let me see if it does. Um, that's the Callahan sub. Way I set it up to. There's filters in that as well. Now notice there's no capacity and I did that on purpose originally. Okay so that's that's the car type filter. Okay that's that's fine. That was the filters I remembered.
I I don't remember them being in, and now now I kind of want to remember how it was before, and I wish they would tell you the update, because I'm my memory can't remember. I'm I'm looking at this and I'm thinking, okay, wait a minute now. Bagged for Industries, okay. So... Here, here's what you can do, guys. And I haven't tried this yet. But remember how... The way... I'm just, I'm, I'm really trying, I'm trying to process this right now. I'm trying to process it the way RTS has done it in the past and how this can be done now. And it's going to take me a little bit of figuring out and testing perhaps uh, to see. But from what I can tell, you should be able to go in, create a bunch of fake industries anywhere and not and have them all tagged for industries because i've already seen it come up on a filter and you'll be able to also logist uh, put into logistics so that those particular industry types you can you can put in cities you can put in all kinds of uh, things here you can have yards that don't even exist in your system it doesn't matter because all you're trying to do is you're trying to route traffic. And that could potentially be the game changer. Again, don't know for sure. I haven't seen, you know, how that will work out. I'm, I'm just, I, I just really want to get a, get a good grip on this. Perhaps I shouldn't be worried about uh, running... In fact, I'm not going to. I'm not going to save this. I'm going to. I'm going to. I'm going to let this go for now, uh, because I wasn't planning on running tonight anyway. So let me. Let me first. Uh, do I want to? Do I want to hold all the traffic? I think I will. In fact, let me go back to loading the save. I'll go back to World RTS. Load that up. Put everything in all hold. Freeze time. three trains on there but this will do is this will give me a little bit of an opportunity here to uh, first of all read the PDF so I don't recall seeing this before I remember seeing all this. I'm going to start I'm going to start right at the stop here.
Okay, so that's the same. That's this. I want to see what the what the exact will change log log says again, just so that I'm making sure that I understand. More filters added. Please see the user guys interacting with AI train. So there's more filters added. Uh, enter is industry config bug fix. Hopefully that isn't going to destroy my one bug, but then fixing that bug, I may still uh, now have an alternative because of the, the, the way they've put in this new filter thing. Um, as I may get, I may start tagging everything for industries pretty soon. Um, I'm thinking that way anyways. Florida is kind of weird because it is it's not so much no see I'm <laughs> Thing is, I'm so simplified right now, and I'd have to go back to more com complexity, which is kind of interesting. But it makes it, it makes it very appealing, because the way I see it right now is there is no reason why you cannot create an industry or multiple industries and filter them. And those industries, they can be, they can be anywhere. They can be a piece of track in the middle of mainline heading to uh i don't know like say north of luda whiskey all you have to do is create one track call it an industry i don't even know you might even be able to use the same track i'm not 100 percent sure on that and all you do is you, you create demand it should call them so now you get into your bridge your bridge trafficking um, I'm not too sure about the trains per se, but at least if you name the train, let's try it. See, I have something called Callahan Sub. Callahan Sub is, a, is, is basically a fake industry, but I did it in such a way so that it would, it's actually not a fake industry. It's actually a real industry, but it doesn't call anything. Yet it was listed in there because that was one of my uh, trains. I called Callahan sub, and I can't I can't tag anything for that, which wouldn't matter anyways because there's no demand for it. Um, so CSX signaling code. Um, it said something about the passenger train. That's good, Florida. More, that's that's good to hear. Fixed error with the westbound. Full volume slider. So now I'll go back into magical uh, interacting with AI train crews. So as I said, we, we've we've gone through this part. We know this is okay. Things change there. Everything looks the same. Um, that looks the same. Now the filter screen is up. That's where it changes. Where I notice it changes.
The spawn points button will return to the spawn point screen where each spawn location is configured. Wait a minute. Say what? Okay, did I miss something? Oh, okay. I thought for a minute you could configure your own spawn points. I, I misread that. Okay. There's the filter button, but I think that was already in there before. Okay. Mixed, this is, this looks a little different. Mixed freight. If tagged for industries and enabled, the cars will be loaded or unloaded based on the industry configuration. Okay. If tagged for industries is disabled, and mixed freight trains will have a random goes in it. That's this will automatically add destination tags. Tagged for industries. This will automatically add destination tags to all cars in the train and is only available for the mixed. This functionality is covered in a separate user guide for figuring and act. Okay, yep. Filter button allows for more customization of which cars will on the generated. specifically filter button allows for further customization the cards that will appear on a generated AI train the passenger or light engine was selected and the filter button is disabled. Three different car filtering options to type of the train. Mixed freight train tagged for industries. Mixed freight train type was selected and the tagged for industries option has been enabled. The filter button will bring up a menu figured local freight train symbols. If a train sy sy symbol is enabled in this list, then cars are randomly chosen based on the industry configuration for all the industries that are served by that train symbol. More than one train symbol can be selected. If none are selected, then cars are randomly chosen from all configured industries. Make sense? Mixed freight trains not tagged for industry. Mixed freight train was selected and the tagged for industries option has not been enabled. Then the filter button brings up a menu with a list of available cards that can appear in the train.
that's you're just basically selecting the cars so if you don't want auto racks on your train or eh, I suppose uh, I can do a lot of different things a lot of damage I can probably end up doing um trying to think of industries do I run into problems that then are being operas but anyways I ain't gonna too much all different are in any category select in the cars and that Amtrak units well cars cannot be enabled for Any other train type beside mixed freight passenger car move? Any other train type the filter button. All the available cars specific to that type. Oh man, it's interesting. Oh, I see. Note in all of the pop up screens that show cars in the list, the background is highlighted gray for any cars that are not installed. These will spawn. Ah! As a stretched Run 8 boxcar. Good, I can eliminate those. Local types are staying the same thing. Okay. I think everything else is the same. Well, that's cool. So, you mean to tell me I can go in? And I can go nuts with this thing now? So will it automatically, um, hold on, hold on a second here. It didn't say whether or not it will automatically pop it up, but I know I was getting trains that were popping it up. It's curious. Let's close that. So that's your domestic can I guess that's what they call the domestic which makes sense that's what it looks like. so that there's your pigs yeah to stable for light power move it's contained it 
it'll be it I'll, I'll be happy when this kind of comes into I don't know how would you say because we have the the ones where you have the uh, the auto racks with the intermodal type thing mind you they're blocked or they're likely blocked I'm just curious about something. Let me let me just try do an experiment for a minute. So we got our filter. Now I'm missing a lot of cars. Well packed. And this is this is good for people like me who don't want to buy every single pack. So I just spawned that. Okay, it's a bow and siding. Let me just take a look. Oh, of course it starts as an empty. Uh, that's right. I wish I wish the containers were not the cards. Did you notice that? See any thing that's missing? Every single type is there. So I think it automatically, at least from what I can tell right now, will not try and take on or add stuff that you don't have. Actually, actually, no. Wait a minute. Maybe I'm maybe I'm getting confused with being on California server. Um, which is interesting. Fortunately, being a server owner, what that means is I'm limiting people from seeing certain things. As far as I know, because I'm the one that's spawning the train, and then. Uh, it's under what's ever on my own particular computer, so that's one of the kind of the drawbacks when you start having too many add-ons is if you're going to be a provider, well, people are going to want to run their stuff. If you don't supply it, then people are going to be like, you know, they're going to want to see their stuff. So... I, I had a comment today about uh, California. And, you know, it was a very, it was a very, I mean, very honest comment to, you know, basically that uh, because there's no California server on RTS anymore, it, it, and I already thought of this too. Because there's no California server, a lot of people do not have anything else other than California, so that's I'll just kind of it takes away from just that alone so way there oh yeah uh blah 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 oh yeah there's the let's do the whisk i don't even know switch Not quite there there's a quarry or something off to the side um this is gonna take a long time to configure 
just just when you think you're got everything figured out then the See, I'm, I'm just loud here. Um, a second. Problem is, I don't have much consideration as to logistics or even what the card types are. But this this really changes the potential. Now, specifying particular demand. As far as I know, you can put that. Just let me let me take a look on that for a minute and I think I can find a spot for example where you'll never see a train I know there's I, I know the NS is active but there are others active here on both sides I know they run one through but I don't know if they run... Oh, no, see, there you go. Oh, wait a minute. Yes, they do. Do they? So sure. No, it isn't. Okay. So, so what you can do here, for example, because you have... Um, if you go AI traffic generation and you've got... Uh, Spawn fight for North Norfolk Norfolk Southern. I don't think do I even have anything. I guess I do. See, I could I could create a random one if I was, you know take all the probabilities down and just have a, ge a randomly generated NS train pop up, I could do it. Um, I'm just I'm trying to think now what the best way to go about. And, and no, I'm not thinking about what to put in NS. Um, so I guess I would go on you. Oh, maybe I was close enough. Over here. Okay. So the way they set it up, like if you see if you get going this way, you eventually run into the there it is right there, see? I don't know, is it is it connected? It is connected. Unit. Oh, the whole thing is connected. I was wrong. Check something out for a minute.
Yeah, I was going to use this, and the reason why I got all of a sudden hung up on this was I was going to use this as a test for the industry. This will be up. Unfortunately, once you spawn these things, you got to have it one way or another because. Crossings. Oh, there it is, right there. I guess it doesn't have its own signal section but I think it's there could be wrong but I think it will spawn I guess uh, so I get I get kind of an approach signal that block or what Oh, I see. Okay. No, I didn't want to do this just to... This is just giving me some ideas. This wasn't really one of them. It's the block that makes sense. Okay. Oh, that protects the other. Ah, I see now. That protects the other section. You don't have one that protects the intermodal ramp, which is through here. Oh, I guess I was wrong. Okay. Hold on a second. Stop the presses. So this is the NS section I was talking about. Dies. There, see? Okay. So while that NS does its thing, that little other section there, which is by the ramp, does not. And that's why I wanted to try this here. Um, there's a lot of... particular ways in which this can be done. And it would take me, uh, I don't know. It, and don't get me wrong, I love this update. It's just going to take me a lot of figuring out. 
So if I was to go through and say here, I'm, I'm looking at the various trains that go through. Um, So you got one stuff that goes to Baldwin. Makes sense. It's phosphate. Way across to Winston. Wherever that is. Broco. Cool. Juice train. That one goes to New Orleans. So it, it exits. See that's that's where it gets interesting. So you have you have a lot of potential What's my hump controller set up for right now? I got all these little empty blocks. And this this here. I got I got I gotta really, really think about this now. Because suddenly Suddenly I have a like Toledo, Ohio, <clears throat> like I got Detroit, Toledo, um, there's so many, like for example, like the auto car right in Toledo and, uh, uh, gondola, gondola scrap steel to Buffalo. I don't know if it would take me to try and go through everything and to find and to find out some real um good stuff. See what well, once you get into box cars then then it really really doesn't matter because you can send box cars all over the damn place and you don't know what the hell they are. But when you have the visible loads then suddenly okay, well that you know that kind of makes you know, make stuff. It makes it makes sense. But I can almost now I can look at this and I can say, okay, um, no, I wouldn't send a, a train to Buffalo. I don't even know how the hell that would work. If there would be a train called Buffalo, or if it would... So, so, like, the point I'm trying to get at here this is I, I'm gonna have to do a lot of thinking about it trust me to say this this works this this will actually work pretty I'm almost certain of it um, but I'm, I'm just trying to get my uh, grasp on how this would work exactly I could probably do some tests um, I try So, because we could do that now, oh, screen, damn it.
Oh, I, I don't care. Like crap, but I don't. Why is it doing that? Okay. Now, of course, the the other issue is you have to create one that has loads and you have to have one that has empties. Uh The local freight symbol m might not be such a big deal. So if I was to say Buffalo Test... Now again, it could be any track really. Um, uh, the only reason why I'm using that particular track is I know cars aren't going to be laid there because it's a dummy track. Totally dummy track. Um, so if I was to generate a capacity 24 hours As soon as you put the you put a process tag into it, then that basically uh, assigns it. Now I, I don't even care about the types it. Does. I to, but I'm not sure or not. Yep. I'm just gonna all, but passenger cars shouldn't. Thing anyways okay so I've got I've got something that uh, the Buffalo test uh, local freight symbol Buffalo um, I try I'm going to try just calling it Buffalo Test L. Let's see what happens. I can't remember. In fact, I may, um,
you could you could create the local uh, freight symbol or the industry tag is Buffalo and you can put this as the uh, the mainline train I'll see why not in fact that'd be kind of pretty cool think about it so this one's gonna empty over all of it Won't let you add it, huh? Set the tracks. Okay. Now, though. It's a train that goes up to, uh, But you can put the the way I the way I set it up was that the buffaloes could go to Selkirk, or well, they can go to something else. But it's for the sake of whatever. Now I've now I've saved that. Um, I've got a test train here. I'm going to. I want to call it here. Oh, okay, never mind. Um, call you test two. Act for industries. That's not showing up. Oh, there it is. There. Well. So what I want to do is, in fact, I'll call it test one. Call the other one test two. Take that for industries. So no, it has nothing to do with the track that it's on right now. I'm just going through this area because, you know. Up to see. Okay, so oops. So we got Buffalo Buffalo. So far they're all loads. Nope. Okay. You put the loads up front, the empties at the back. Got both empty and loaded auto racks is what I figured it would have. But the thing is here. Now I'll spawn another regular train. Should give me a buffalo, but I, it doesn't. Not necessarily will. It should be in order as well. Shouldn't give me a Callahan. This Callahan has no demand. There's your buffalo right there. See, so it picked one out of that. This one it put three empty. Back. It's it's 
gonna be it's gonna get interesting to say the least. So it's 1008. I man, I got bog my mind on this one. Um the test is is accurate. It works. So I'm gonna delete this for now because I I don't want to put this in here yet. Put the uh got uh, uh, some time to work on this tomorrow. Oh, Buffalo test load. Yeah. Like, look at the card. I can't find it. Um, what was the other? Oh, yeah. I had the. That gets rid of the industries. Then I just. That. Let's go in. So there was a change in um, Cajon. I'll take a quick look at it. I did upgrade it. I don't know what the hell the change is. You never know with these things. There's some assets or something. Um, oops, maybe I did in the pro. Let's take a quick look. I honestly, I don't run California at all right now. I don't run anything other than um, uh, I don't run anything other than Waycross at the moment. But let me just take a look and see if there's you know something to catch my eye. The home. Fly around. No. Fly around, see if I see anything. I don't know what uh, assets are. Supposed to have changed something to do with the traffic. Or I don't know what the hell it was. Not gonna. Buy I might just fly by this and not even know. That rope that was there before. I guess it was. But just dies right there. Let's just fly through. Um. I suppose I can take a look over at what's Colton. Uh, much, was there that much? Uh, hold on a second here. I, 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 okay. Was there that many uh, houses and crap there? I just don't remember that much. I guess there was. It's just... it looked a little busier for some reason. There's new assets somewhere. I 
I spent too much. Let's see if something can. Simple. I don't know. It's not a huge update, so I don't know what was. Sleep just <laughs> it's nice to run and all, I guess. Uh, I'll let somebody else uh figure that one out. For <laughs> I mean, it's downloaded, but I don't know. Great that it, there's upgrade updates for it all, and that. No, that that's a that's a big update though, as far as the uh, just the filters. I mean, that changes the logistics, that changes, that really changes quite a bit. I might make a posting for on the, uh, uh, the form about that. Um, who knows who's reading the form these days? There's some on the other forms that could probably benefit from it if they know the power of it. But um, I don't see a reason why, you know, I, I, I'm... I'm just, I'm trying to think in terms of RTS, what may or may not be here now, as far as, and this is, this is why I was very hesitant about going RTS too. Uh, I'm not saying that there's not things that I can do that can be even better, um, but I'm a little tired right now, so maybe I'm not thinking straight, but as far as I can tell, no, it doesn't have the waybill mentality, but it has the demand ability, and it doesn't have a good rand. I don't think the random number generator has been approved. So what'll happen is you're adding a lot more. Uh, you're adding a lot more random potential. That will drown out the minimals. It may give more potential to over capacity on your maximums. Hopefully that makes sense. Because what happens is when you add more pool, add more to the waybill pool, and you're you're bringing in not only are you bringing in industries like say for example from Florida, you'd be bringing in pretty much every industry um, and you don't have to here's the other thing too um, and, and this is something this is this is something where I suppose you know an RTS would have an advantage on and that is it's not train specific the filter is train specific so what that means is um, each and any train could potentially have anything for it. Now, the cool thing about that is your lumber that I like always mention and your proper auto rack flow and not having various car types that doesn't, you know, like on, on particular trains. Now you take it out of the equation. So, you know, you'll get the auto racks out They'll only be into the auto rack trains if you want to have it that way or or if not but having the flow in in play gives you the ability to then uh have trains that not only supply your industries but also supply 
uh, bridge traffic. Especially, especially when you're thinking anything coming into Florida would probably be either going to go to the industries of the A line or they're going to go to the S line. And anything coming out of the S line would not go to the A line. But you would want it to go to the various cities. Now I had it set up for the tags, but there's there's no reason why you can't have it um, set up so that it's in the proper train symbols. I mean, there, there's a there's a lot of different things that you. Get it go to a proper uh like i i mean right now the way i have i gotta i really have to reconsider um unfortunately i've already i've already got the hump set up for things but now i gotta reconsider actually having the train symbols possible i guess i already have blocks but i can that's the other thing i can do as well is I, I can create the train symbol with the various blocks. Say, for example, uh, a Selkirk train might have a block for Buffalo, might have a block for Syracuse. You know, I might be able to divide it, a little divided a little that way. I don't know. It's a lot to think. <laughs> so. It's still a lot of work, but uh, at least, you know, there's some potential there. Um, I may not take advantage of it right away, to be quite honest, but definitely, uh, it's definitely room for some improvement. There's, maybe I'll slowly, you know, slowly go at it. Just right now, I don't have it. So, <laughs> maybe tomorrow, we'll see. Anyways, I'm going to call it for tonight. 1021. I just wanted to check that out. Max for the Maybe I'll check it out tomorrow. I'll have some night's sleep. Tomorrow I'll think about uh, the various things that I can or can't do. As far as I know, the up a lot of potential. So it's a, it's a definite plus. And uh, I don't know what this bug fix thing is, but even if it even if it got a, there was that one bug that I liked. That allowed it to go to zero and allowed you to stop and then get re automatically reassign a train. Um, I might be able to get away with that. And it doesn't matter now because now I here's here's the real cool thing. Before I I end this, what's really cool about it now is um, there's no reason why I can't have like well here's the other thing too. There's no reason why Waycross, instead of just having stuff coming into Florida, there's no reason why Waycross can't redistribute. Boy, and it does. Like right now, I, I made it simple. I just have it come feed Florida. But when I th thought about that, I was just like, okay, I'm feeding a lot of Florida, but there's a lot that else that I can uh, do besides New Orleans, uh, Birmingham, there's there's all kinds of different ways. I mean, you can have stuff coming coming off of the the I um, ninety five corridor, having it come down and then serve off into Alabama or or something like that. I I'd have to take a look at it again. I'm you know, it's not necessarily my expertise in that area, so I'd have to. Consider, there's so many lines and not linear. It's not linear. It's not really a spoke, like what Barstow was in the middle of a transcon. It was pretty easy to say, okay, stuff coming from the north can just serve the west and the south, and the east, and stuff from the west can serve the north or can serve the south and the east. It had, it had so many directions. Here, it's it's not so simple because in some ways. Those connections can be made without having to come to Waycross to begin with. I just have to figure out what those connections are, and it doesn't have to be perfect. 
long as it leads to something that makes sense. That so I don't want to overthink. Definitely a lot of potential here. Um, I'll play along with it. Actually, maybe who knows? Uh, well, this weekend I'm okay, but Astoria that'll give me some time to think. Well, but um, yeah, but maybe in a couple weeks or three weeks from now. I'll be on with Ski. We'll have a talk. Uh, I throw some ideas back and forth because I really think the more this gets developed, the less likely RTS2 is required. I'll have a talk. I'll post a message about it maybe later. I don't know if I'll do it today. Anyway, sorry. I'm rambling. I let it go. Have a good one, guys. We'll talk to you later.